Hi guys, I'm Mochi and welcome back to Evernight. As you can see, some stuff's gone wrong. <laughs> so we got a zombie raid and um, they changed one of my villagers, which scared the other villagers who all escaped the safety of the library and came out and, well, you can see the results here. So I've got two weakness potions. And if I can get them close enough together, <laughs> that should work. Okay, so let's go ahead and give this a shot. Okay, so when I told uh, R. Ryan about my problem, he suggested a water bucket. We can move him with a water bucket. Alright, let's give it a shot. That's way better than hop in the boat and hope they don't kill me. And there's only one I could do that with anyway because of the cats. So let's give this a try. It's going to wash away all my torches, but we can... Uh... Alrighty, that's, that's working. Alright, dude, you go elsewhere. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, that works perfectly! Oh, I've got caps lock on. Yay! Okay. Got those two? Got those guys? Let's golden apple this and we'll be good to go. One for you, and one for you, and one for you, and one for you, and one for you. <laughs> All right, so that's that problem solved. Let's get some torches down so we don't have a whole bunch of spawning in here anyway. I really need to do something about the lighting in here and the floor. What is? Oh, it's a cattail. That's a cattail coming through the wall. Okay. <laughs> Oh, I backed into the dragon. <laughs> Alright, well that should take care of our darkness problem. And our zombie problem. And hey, we'll probably get better deals out of it. So, it's not all bad. Success! Alright, so everybody is back and we are back in business here. Oh, and it was our Silk Touch Villager, and he's back, and our Feather Falling Villager. And again, like I said, yep, better deals. All right. And we have some additional villagers. What is that noise? What am I hearing? All right, well, let's get these guys into the village. Uh, F3 plus B. Oh, you know what? Let's start with uh, you guys who aren't a thing yet. Shoot! I hit one. Oh, that's no good. Yeah, he's gonna be mad at me. Uh, there. Alright, go on. Don't go in the hole. Alright, let's fix up our holes here. Alright, and our villagers are now safely back at home. Let's slab them in. Oh, you know what? Let's slab in from this side because we also need to move this lectern so we don't have a repeat. 
Now that horrible endeavor. Okay. So this is a bad place for a lectern. <laughs> Lessons learned. Hey, Golem. So yeah, this happened. Oh, I'm still got a 3 plus B going. So this happened because of the zombies. Unfortunately, he is upstairs far away from my village where he can't really help them. Here we go. All right, door's back in place. Last time, you get to the end, so we got some chorus flowers. And now, we've got a chorus flower farm and chorus fruits. Now all we need is blaze rods and we can make some end rods. And we've got a cactus farm now, which is awesome. Because it's been entirely too long since I was growing plants that could stab me to death. But I think we've set up our cactus farm a little smarter than our berry farm. Where we can now walk down through the middle between each of them and behind to get anything that falls back there and gather them without getting poked. <laughs> Uh oh. Let's go ahead downstairs in hopes that our cat doesn't hang out with the cactus too much. Okay. And as you can see, we've made just all the potions of slow falling. And that is because we have big plans to get back together and go back to the end. Try and get some shulker boxes and some elytra. But that's going to be a little later. And of course we have a visiting pigman. Or what is he now? Zombie piglin? Yep, we have a visiting zombie piglin. <laughs> Alright, so... Hmm, we need a Christmas tree in our house. But this roof is a little short. This is the short floor. Might be better up here, though it's not the main floor. Now, obviously, it's going to be a temporary thing. It's just for Christmas, so we can pretty much put it wherever, but uh, maybe in here. We're doing a lot of work in here lately. I want this to be a pretty tall tree. Probably about there is good, though. Hmm. Let's move those down.
I think that looks like a pretty good little tree. Okay, so we're going to need some scaffolding. So if we just alter up the way these are pointing, we can get a good variety. Of ornaments. <laughs> Hmm, I only have two cow heads on me. One, nope, oh, wrong direction. Mm, are those too close together? Uh, I think they might be. Oh no! Oh bummer. Oh hey, it's still touched, so I got it back. There we go. All right, I need, I think, a little more variety with the heads, maybe. Alrighty, so we got some more. Let's see how that looks. Oh, I forgot. I bet I have some more down in the Raise the Roof shop. I had a couple of heads in there. I'll have to go check that out in a minute. For now, yeah, and oh, I guess that's the chorus fruit growing there. Let's see. We might have all of the little. Oh, nope, nope. There's one. It's at the back, though. I almost hate to put this at the back. Um, kind of like it better, I think. Um, okay, well, what of the normal heads would look? Mm, nah, it would have to be the cow head, because otherwise it's going to be too much of the same. Let me keep it the drown there. And cow, there. And we have a tree full of fun festive bubbles. Don't think about it too much. <laughs> oh, it really does kind of need some on the lower branches, doesn't it? We're going to have to go find more. But look how that's coming along. Doesn't it look great? I think that works really well. All right, we need to go find some more. Also, we could probably use, reuse some of these, but first, let's go check our Raise the Roof shop because I know I put some uh, some heads in there. Very long time ago now. Meow. Meow. Now, you know what? We should probably have our bow handy just in case. Oh, we got a cow head and another phantom head. All right, so we've got it. A... Uh, that's a zombie walking on my door somewhere. This door. Okay. Oh, that's right. Uh, there was a new cat. That's what we went fishing for in the first place. Okay. Hold on. Let's go sneak on over and say hello.
Wait, is that is that my jelly or is that a new jelly too? Yes. Cat friend. Now let's go see if this one is also a new cat or if that's one of mine. Yeah, it just got spooked and I don't see a collar, so I think that is a new jelly. One fish! Yay! Cat friends! Alright, well let's go ahead and get back to work. Oh, you know what? I think that works. That works because they're like hanging down. They're little bobbles. I think it works. Yeah, that'll work. And then we'll put one of these guys there, I think. He's far enough away that works. Nope. Mm. There we go. Oh yeah, I think that works well. I think that's looking nice. Okay, that works, I think. Oh my goodness, we may have to turn down weather. That is loud. There we go. Oh no, we got two salmons together. Hmm. That's not gonna work. Uh, what should we put there? Doesn't look quite the same though. Yeah, that works. I think if we can find a better one. We'll replace it. <laughs> Okay. And now there's one right there. I guess we'll go Phantom. And that just leaves Tuna for that one. Like that, maybe, and like that. And if we can find some other heads to put up there, we'll definitely do it. All right, so. Now we need a tree skirt. Alright guys, so we have our Christmas tree. Yay! I think that works. You like my ah, Christmas tree? Look at that. That's awesome. It's full of fish bubbles. Yay! And phantoms. Merry Christmas. That's so great. Thank you. I'm glad uh, you like it. Okay, the anvil's down in my cellar. Okay. I just brought you up here to look at my tree. 
All right, so we built our Christmas tree for the house, and we have one more tree to work on. Well guys, I'm not sure it's quite done, but I think that's as far as we're going to get on it for today. Okay guys, well that was a very tree-filled episode, but I think we're going to have to stop here for today. Next time we're going to head back to the end with Orion and possibly Sue Cube, I'm not sure yet. And we're going to get us some shulker boxes and some elytra hopefully and... Uh, That'll actually make it a lot easier to do more on that tree. <laughs> but we got a good start, I think. So I hope you guys had fun today. I know I did. And I'll see you next time. Bye!